So I'm gonna let you guys in on a little secret on how to increase your bat speed five to 10 miles an hour in as little as two weeks from the comfort of your own home while also improving your swing mechanics. My name is Trey Sykes, and as you can see over here, I was the 2014 Division I All-American. And towards the end of my career, I was known for one thing, and that was hitting. But it wasn't always like that. See, my junior year in high school, I had a batting average of 180. So I finished my junior year with a 180 batting average, and I knew I only had one season left. And I had two weeks until my first summer ball game, so I decided to go out to the cage. And for the next two weeks, I wanted to work on my mechanics and try to get better before the summer ball season started. So I get down to the cages and I'm hitting, I'm yanking everything, everything's to the pull side. I'm not really getting good contact. And this random guy just walks up behind me as I'm hitting and watches. So he stands there for about five to 10 swings. And it's, it's a little weird at first, right? And then he just says, you know, why don't you try hitting one to the opposite field? And I'm just looking behind him like, who is this guy, you know? And I, you know, I continue to keep hitting and he interrupts me again. He says, hey, why don't you try out my new bat? And it has this weird knob right here above the hands. And at first I was like, you know, that, that's a weird looking bat. I'm not going to swing it, you know? So I continue my hitting session and he inter interrupts me again. And he's like, no, seriously, why don't you try using this bat? You don't have anything to lose. So just take a couple swings with it, see if you like it. So I grabbed the bat from him and I pick it up and I initially I could feel it was a little bit heavier than my normal game bat, but it wasn't anything crazy. So I take two to three swings with it and you know, it felt good. It felt like I was swinging my normal bat. So then I go back to my game bat and I could instantly tell that it felt much lighter in my hands. And that very first swing, I smoked one up into the left center of the cage. So I did what anybody else would do, right? I picked the bat right back up, took five to 10 swings with it, and bat went back to my game bat and the same thing. You know, the bat just flowed through the zone just a little bit better. And when I got done with that round, I stepped out of the cage and he says to me, if you're willing to put in the work, I will teach you how to hit. And I had nothing to lose here. I just hit 180 my junior year. So I decided to take him up on that offer. So for the next two weeks, uh, we're, for five days a week, we're working in the cage together. So we get up to my first summer ball game and we're facing our crosstown rival. And I get up to the plate, first at bat of the game, and we're facing this lefty, right? So he throws me this two seam fastball that cuts right back over the middle of the plate. And I just put a good swing on it. Up to that point, that is the best a ball had ever come off my bat. And sure enough, I hit a home run out the left center. It was at that moment that I had my epiphany and I knew that this was my avenue. I knew that if I just kept training with this bat and doing this program, that I would get better. Because in just two weeks of swinging this bat, I'd hit my first high school home run in my career. So fast forward three years later, and I was elected as a Division I All-American. You know, a lot of people ask me, what changed with my swing? Well, I'll tell you, I learned the number one key to hitting, and that is how to stay inside the baseball. And I learned that by swinging this bat. See, this is the Camwood Hands and Speed Trainer. And what we've done is we've added weight right here above the hands. So whenever you start your swing, this added weight's gonna drive your hands down to the ball, creating that proper bat path of staying inside the ball. And I always get asked, how do I increase my bat speed and my power? So it's kind of like going to the gym. If you wanna get stronger, you go to the gym and you lift heavy weights, right? Well, it's no different if you wanna increase your bat speed and increase your power. You wanna swing and train with a heavier bat. But the issue with all the heavy bats on the market right now is they're all inloaded. So all the weight is down here on the barrel of the bat. And what that's gonna do is it's gonna make that bat way too heavy for your kid to swing, right? So whenever they go to start their swing, it's gonna break down their mechanics. But see, what we've done is we've added the weight right here above the hands to where it makes it much easier for you to control and the bat doesn't feel as heavy as it actually is. So it's kind of like the sledgehammer here. If we were to hold this from the handle, all of the weight is down here on the end, just like all the other heavy training bats on the market, right? So if I were to go to swing this, this is way too heavy and my mechanics are gonna break down, right? So what I want you to do is think about holding this sledgehammer from right below the weight. So now this is much easier for me to control. So it's no different than with this Camwood bat. All the weight is right here above the hands, so it's much easier for you to control and you're able to still swing it while maintaining your mechanics. It actually improves your mechanics because it teaches you how to take your hands to the ball and stay inside it to create that proper bat path. 
And I always get asked the question, you know, who is this bat for? And it's for any baseball player or softball player that wants to increase their bat speed, their power, and improve their swing mechanics, okay? I don't care if you're six years old or if you play in the majors, this bat will help you increase your power, your bat speed, and improve your mechanics all at the same time. So real quickly, I wanna show you a video of JR, who's only eight years old, who's been training with this bat. Good. Good. So now that you know that this bat is the key to increasing your bat speed, your power, and improving your mechanics, you're probably thinking, well, how do I use it? Is there any specific drills that I need in order to get the most results out of this bat? And the answer to that is yes. So we created our hour-long Coach's Guide to Hitting DVD, where we go through the exact drills to do with this bat in order to get the most results. In this DVD, we also talk about our hitting philosophy, and we also have a guest appearance from Tony Gwynn, which I'm sure some of y'all have already seen the Tony Gwynn video that he did with our bats, but Tony really dives deep into his approach at the plate and what made him such a successful hitter. So now that you know that you need this bat and you have the drills in order to get the most success with it, I always get asked the question, well, how do I know that I'm doing the drills correctly? So what I've done is I've created the Camwood Advanced Hitting Facebook group, which is a private Facebook group that you're gonna get access to whenever you purchase your Camwood. And you'll be able to upload videos and interact with the Camwood community so you know that you're doing the drills properly. So not only is this bat gonna increase your bat speed, your power, and improve your swing mechanics, but your son's confidence is gonna skyrocket. So I wanna show you this quick review of Gray, who is eight years old, who went through our Camwood 30 Day All-American program, and these are the results that he got. Hello, my name is Jeff McDaniel. And I'm Gray McDaniel, and I'm eight years old. Last year, throughout the season, we had a little confidence struggle, and we ended up with 21 strikeouts. We went looking for something that could be a good solution, possibly some old school way. So we ended up finding a video of Tony Gwynn touting the Camwood bat. You can't get much better of a hitter than Tony Gwynn, so we had to give it a try. So we spent the summer doing a 30-day All-American program, and his bat speed just jumped off the charts, and his confidence soared. So his first tournament back in the fall season, Gray here hit back to back to back in the park home runs to the fence. A few months later, he hits another one to the fence to win a tournament for the glove. Needless to say, the program has done wonders for Gray, and it's invaluable to have the access to the All-American 30-day program and be able to send videos in so you can get all the great feedback from Trey Sykes. It's been a blessing for us, and we look forward to continuing our education and seeing where this young man can take it. Thank you, Camwood Bats. Do you know what it's like to hit with confidence, to go up to the plate just knowing that you're going to get a hit that at bat? Well, it's kind of like that old Ken Griffey Jr. game, Nintendo 64. And if you play that game, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Because if you walk up to the plate as Ken Griffey Jr., his hitting circle was the entire strike zone. And I don't care what pitcher you were facing and where the ball was pitched. If you're hitting in that game as Ken Griffey Jr., you just know that you're going to get a hit. So now I want you to imagine your son walking up to the plate with that amount of confidence, just knowing that I don't care what pitcher I'm facing, I'm about to get a hit right here. It will change them dramatically. So whenever you get your Camwood Hand Speed Trainer today, you're also going to get access to the Coach's Guide to Hitting DVD, and you're going to get access to the Facebook group. So you'll have everything that you need to be successful with this bat. I knew from where the bat was built, that it was something that was going to be successful and that could really help my parents. Right. So I went online and found out this was a Camwood guy. And you know, I ordered a couple for him. Right, right. And this is the best teaching tool that I've run across for young kids in the game. All fathers, parents, coaches, this is the best teaching tool to use your hands, stay inside the ball, create the back path that you need consistently to, to, to have a good swing.